Okay, hello everybody. Welcome to Sleek Toots. Let's model this camera. I start with the plane uh, and yeah, nothing very special. Uh, I'm using my uh, team and my own keyboard shortcuts here so everybody who wants them can grab them from the s description mm. yeah just basic basic modeling mm. The camera consists pretty much only cubes and cylinders, which makes makes it quite easy to make. I'm using quite a lot of the bevel function yeah more more cylinders This is my first screen capture uh, tutorial with audio, so so it might not be the most enjoyable one, but I think this will get better over time. There is always this silence when you don't have anything to say that's that's difficult to get rid of yeah it's also already looking like a camera uh, yeah, like you can see from the, the the screen keys, the the keyboard shortcuts, mm, they aren't the normal Blender shortcuts. I'm using my own, so so you cannot really follow this tutorial with with default Blender. Okay, this is a nice little trick. When you have an object, then you just use the pivot point as center, and then you just copy and use the repeat last, which copies nicely all the pieces ok 
Okay, it's time to make some materials. I have this basic glossy uh, node group saved, which is very handy. I use it almost for every material in this tutorial. It has a basic curve and glossy and diffuse, and you can select how much glossy you can see from the Fresnel uh, type Fresnel, Fresnel kind of uh, I don't know fall of thing yeah the file name is camera 007 which means I, I have recorded this quite many times already. Always something keeps missing or, or I forgot to turn on the screen keys or something. But luckily these are only 10 minute modeling sessions so it's not that big of a deal to uh, record it all over again and uh, you also get very fast in in modeling this when you repeat it all over again yes materials materials Some nice brown color. Once again, basic glossy. That's very handy to have in the saved for for reusage. Okay. We are almost almost ready here, but just some lighting tweaks, adding some sun lamps. A shortcut what I just did like adding an image texture is f uh, con control T but it it comes with the node wrangler add-on so it's not default but most people should use node wrangler any and anyways so so it's it, it's there when you need it Ah, here I'm. I'm uh, using the object uh, 
texture coordinate from the empty which is very easy to move around that's very handy for this kind of gradient effects and now I'm adding this I, I I I was thinking I could put little icon borders rounded icon borders to this is a handy little trick uh, which actually doesn't work when you use depth depth of field with the camera but for this scene it's it's okay so you model out the borders and then you just add hold out material which when you put the transparency on from film tab you can get transparent very handy alright this is pretty much it some last render settings and let's render this out so I hope you had fun fall oh yeah one funny story I was in the woods no 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 I don't have any funny stories this is pretty much it and uh, see you next time bye bye